everybody what's up how's your mama doing now everybody now everybody heard about Snooky's phone getting hacked and she been having new pictures of herself on the phone now you gotta ask this question one how did the media get those pictures so fast and why was there new pictures on her cell phone now people think about those two questions how did they get that cell phone now here's another you probably think it a maybe because it was the media that hacked her phone no it ain't, that ain't it or b she took them new pictures and sent that sent those pictures to the media I think B is the one I think she I think B is the answer B is that good question because every time you hear about a actress phone getting hacked and she's having new pictures you're feeling sorry for the stars not realizing hey she took those pictures and she sent them to the media just to get more publicity why would you take new pictures of yourself send them to the media so they could write a fucked up story saying hey Scarlett Johansson's cell phone got hacked uh, and she had new pictures on it or Snooky's uh, cell phone got hacked it had new pictures why would you take pictures new pictures of yourself on your cell phone unless if you want to get publicity it is just as, the same as when Kim Kardashian and Ray J did that sex tape same with Paris Hilton when she did that sex tape same it's it's the same just to get publicity now I'm gonna put two stories in the in the description box and you tell me what you think about this story because to me I think she did it just to get publicity and another thing is this is kind of throwing me off kind of throwing me off because she's pregnant right and she's been pregnant now she's a few months pregnant I think she would have probably been showing I think it was one picture when they showed that she had a belly on and it kind of got me questioning, kind of got me questioning, like, okay, where's the stomach? Why ain't she showing her, like, why, she's supposed to be pregnant, why ain't she showing? In other pictures of the media, she's showing her stomach that she's got a belly on her. You don't see no belly on her whatsoever. For real, you don't see no stomach on her. So you got to question yourself. Did she take this, take those pictures beforehand and waited to send them pictures to the media, or that, or is her whole pregnancy ordeal is a fucking scam, a fraud, a fake? You gotta ask these questions. Y'all can sit there, oh, in front of you, you need to shut the fuck up. No, these are the questions you need to ask. It's all about these people playing. These damn celebrities playing y'all as fucking fools. When I say something about them, y'all want to get butt hurt and take up for them. And then in the end, you find out they be playing your ass like a fucking fiddle. And that's how it is. Everybody knows that JY's titties are fake. She was honest about that. I still, well, I still have to fuck JY. She can't find me, but, but Snooky, that's one thing that's it's tripping me out is how the media's got these pictures first before it even hit the internet the media's got these pictures first before any website posts pictures of her nude now like I, it goes right back to that question did she send them pictures to the media to get publicity why does she have new pictures of herself on her cell phone? See, every celebrity has a tabloid's phone number, like Inside Edition, Entertainment Tonight, uh, the newspaper, the news, MTV News, E Channel. They have those those numbers. Your problem is like why to get publicity? Now, 
now since this is coming out and I'm asking these questions y'all gonna be sitting there thinking did she really do this for a stunt is this really a big stunt she's pulling yes it is a big stunt she's pulling and that's one thing I don't get why would you take new pictures of yourself send it to the media for a big stunt that's a question if you if you are an actress and you about to do a movie why would you do this if you've been recognized and you getting work why would you sit there and take new pictures of yourself send them to the media to get more publicity how much publicity can one person get when you pull shit like that when you pull shit like that to me when you pull shit like that man it's telling me that you can't get enough of the limelight you can't get enough of the people judging you Like for real, I, she probably even tweeted these damn pictures, man. Knowing how she is, I'm for real. If I was a celebrity, I'm be thinking how much work can I get. I want to be thinking, I want to be thinking how much publicity I can get by showing my dick to everybody. If I want to show my dick to everybody, I go to Playgirl or do porn. I don't want to be sitting up there texting, texting the media the, my photos on my penis, on, on my dick and balls, and that's all it is. A fucking publicity stunt. Stop believing in the fucking hype. That's all it is. That's all this girl wants to do. I'ma show my titties and my hoo ha off because I want more publicity. Sit your oompa loompa ass down somewhere. One of these days, some, you think that damn punch in the face should have woke her ass up? No, I think somebody needs to bust her ass and make her realize. I feel bad for that, even if she, I don't know, I feel bad for that child she about to have. Now, if that baby, now, if, when that child comes out and grows up, grows up, that boy's going to be humili like, humiliated, embarrassed. Because his mama is pulling these stunts. Like how, I, how would he feel when his mama comes to pick him up and she crashing into the school, or she smacking the teacher, <laughs> or she's drunk so bad that she's showing off her <laughs> to everybody. See what I'm saying? I don't think she's gonna be a good mother anyway. Because she parties too much. I think she needs to give that child up for adoption. Because all she wants to do is party. She can say she wants to be a mother. But I don't think taking your baby to a club is being a good mother. Or trying to feed, trying to give your child a shot of tequila is going to do it. For real. If I was her, give up that baby for adoption so that baby can have a life to live instead of sitting up here having a mother like Snooky. And, uh, and, uh, I just don't get it. I just don't get her. Because one thing is, man, don't you think you need a... I just don't get, man. I just don't get it, man. You send new pictures of yourself to the media just to get more publicity. And then you lie about getting your shit hacked. Which everybody knows now that you've been lying from day one. I just don't get it, man. People need to realize, man, these fuckers going to do anything just to get more publicity, stay in the limelight. Look, the Jersey Shore is over. You get about your show about you and about uh, your show with Jay Wow is about to come on. I just, uh, these fucking people, man, they don't know what to do.
I just uh, I just don't get about this girl, man. Is that this girl would do anything to get more publicity? I'm just waiting for a sex tape, man, so she can really embarrass herself and make her family feel disappointed in her because she's a piece of shit. Yeah, I watched the Jersey Shore. First time I seen sex, I thought she was a cute little Oompa Loompa. Now she's just a nasty ass hoe that can't keep her freaking legs closed. That's a fucking alcoholic. She's an alcoholic. I did, I'm telling you, man, she has nothing but a fucking alcoholic. She can sit there and say, I'm not an alcoholic, but she's a fucking alcoholic because only alcoholics, only alcoholics will sit there, I'm not an alcoholic. If you're not an alcoholic, I bet she can't go two years without a drink or two years without being in the fucking club. If you're going to be a parent, bitch, you better step up and be a parent. Stop trying to drink, party, and bullshit. I'm tired of this shit, man. Every celebrity can sit, every celebrity has sat there and said that their phone got hacked. If your phone got hacked, that means that the people that hacked your phone would have had every phone number on your contact list. They would have had every phone number that you had in your phone. They would have had every last one of them and called every last person. You ain't hear about no phone numbers or popping up. Nothing. All you heard was pictures. That clearly shows you that it was a it was a, a big big scam, big full of shit, a stunt, a big stunt. Because if I would have hacked her phone, I would have took the phone numbers too and started passing out certain phone numbers to certain that belongs to certain celebrities. See what I'm saying? But they say all they got was these pictures. Now, come on now. A good hacker can get them phone numbers and the information. Not just photos. See what I'm saying? But the media's got the pictures. Now, when the phone numbers brought up, I would have hacked them. I would if I was a hacker. I would have hacked the phone, took the numbers and erased her list, and took them pictures, or something like that. But these pictures show up. I, I'm telling you, man, this is a big scheme, big stunt that she's pulling just to get, to, just to stay in the media, into the lim, into the lim, into the limelight, because there's no way in hell. The media will have the pictures before the internet. See what I'm saying? She e she sent them. She texted the media those pictures. She texted them to them. I'm sorry. I bet you. I bet you another celebrity is gonna say their phone got hacked and there's new pictures on it. When that fucking happens, it clearly show you that's that every time a celebrity say my phone's been hacked and there's new pictures on it it shows you I've been telling the truth from the get go they will show you that I've been telling the truth that this that these people lie about their phones getting hacked they sent them pictures to the media they tweet them send them everything just to stay in the limelight I'm I'm sorry but them, that limelight is going to go dim one day and then it's gonna go out. Yo, 15 minutes of fame is almost up, Snooky. You don't need to try to send pictures of your naked ass to the media just to stay in the limelight. You're a short, pregnant Oompa Loompa with a poof. A poof? A poof, man. You know how old that poof shit is? That poof is so old, man. It's all in there, Methuselah. Oh, the poof, the little poof. Look, man, I seen white girls with poof. Back in high school, I seen white girls and black girls and Latino girls and Asian girls with the poof before Snooky ever brought it into the limelight. So that poof shit is old as hell. And that's all that is, man. I wish people would stop kissing these people's ass. 
She sent them pictures to the media, man, just to stay in the limelight. Bitch, you pregnant. Who wants to see your pregnant ass? Well, many, many perverts out there probably want to see your naked ass, pregnant ass. I, I'm just, I know what, I wish they would. Uh, it's going to be, she's going to be, she's going to do a porn movie. I bet you she's going to do a porn movie. Going down on Snooky. Snooky in the Smurfs. The Oompa Loompas. No, they'll be like the Orange Smurfs. Snooky is the leader. The Orange Smurfs. <laughs> but that's how it is, man. Y'all gotta, y'all gotta think about these questions. How did the media get the pictures before anybody else? Unless she sent them to them. There's no phone. Her phone didn't get hacked. Because it's one thing if a hacker was going to hack her phone, they would have took more than them pictures. That's all that is. Hackers would have took more than them fucking pictures. <laughs> now you haven't heard. I'm just saying. I think she sent them pictures to the media just to stay in the limelight. I wish people would just think about this and really... Like, okay, did she really have her phone hacked? I mean, if it, this is how to solve a problem. This is how to solve this little problem with the cell phones and shit being hacked from the celebrities. I think every celebrity should get rid of a fucking cell phone so they won't have a problem if the story is true. You can't always believe what is on the internet. You can't always believe what you see on TV. Because anybody can make up a story. See, the media's made up lies about people for so long that that people believe it's the truth. Now, y'all believe? Do y'all believe in Snooky's phone getting hacked? Hell no, not not me. I know that for sure. I really don't because she's full of shit. She's full of shit. My phone got hacked, and you pregnant, how did them people get them photos? That's a question that I'm asking. How did the the media get them photos? If she's pregnant, she would have been showing her her stomach would have been showing how big big it got and whatever. Cause what was it back in months ago? Every, the world find out like months ago she had to be like what four months pregnant now four or five months pregnant or something with a belly on her something but them pictures show that she ain't got a pregnancy belly or what a pregnant belly on her I'm telling y'all y'all gotta ask these questions y'all gotta figure out what's really going on because one thing is People got it. People, you need to ask this because I know I'm asking this to find out there's more lies to the story. Oh, what Afro? There's always two sides of every story. Yeah, it is. It's called bullshit. I call it bullshit. I smell bullshit because it is bullshit. This girl is bullshitting everybody. Every day, it's the same old thing with these damn celebrities. Oh, my phone got hacked, but they don't have a fucking cell phone. Get a house phone. Get a dial up. Get them rotary phones. Get them old back in the day and the Griffin phones. And quit being a, quit being a well. I'm telling you, man, I can't stand these motherfuckers. You can tell they trying to get into publicity, be, trying to stay in the, the limelight because all they do is show their naked ass to everybody. Like they just showed it on the inside of this shit. Miley Cyrus with a corset and then she took it down off her Twitter. I'm a good one. But like I said, man, y'all y'all don't believe in the bullshit. Well, ladies and gentlemen, this has been Afro Joe. A, uh, Afro Joe the Wookiee. Follow me on Twitter. And I follow Joe Dewicki. Subscribe to my channel, CeeLo Jr. 2, CeeLo Jr. 3 on YouTube. Tell me what you think in a comment or video response. If you don't like what I got to say, kiss my ass and burn the hair. If you like what I got to say, tell me what you think about this topic because I think this is a big ass stunt that she's pulling. For real. That's all that is to it. No ifs, ands, or buts about it. A big ass scam. 
I don't give a fuck if y'all get mad at me, but it's a big scam. That's how it is. Thank y'all. Peace.